Hello dear students, hope you are doing good. Welcome to YouTube channel Learn with Gisela. Let's take up an important question of compound interest in this video. A certain sum of money is invested at the rate of 10% per annum compound interest, the interest compounded annually. If the difference between the interest of third year and first year is Rs. 1105, find the sum invested. Now in this question, they have given a certain sum of money is invested at the rate of 10%. Now this 10% rate is compounded annually and they have also given us the difference between the interest of third year and first year which is Rs. 1105 and we have to find the sum invested that is we have to find the principal. Now let's start with the solution. Difference between third year and first year interest is Rs. 1105. Rate of interest is 10% per annum which is compounded annually and we have to find the sum invested that is we have to find the principal. Now simple interest formula we shall use for first year interest that is SI is equal to P into R into T upon 100. Now P is the principal which we don't know into R rate of interest is 10% and time period is 1 year because we have to calculate for first year. So we shall write P into 10 into 1 upon 100 which is equal to P by 10. Now to calculate the interest for the third year we require the principal of the third year and as we know the principal of the third year is actually the amount at the end of second year that is given by formula a2 is equal to P in bracket 1 plus R upon 100 whole raised to power N. So with this formula we can find out the amount at the end of second year. Further we shall put the values. P is the principal which we have to find. Further in bracket 1 plus 10 upon 100 whole raised to power 2. Over here rate of interest is 10 and number of years is 2. So accordingly we have put the values. Now for the 0 and 0 will cancel and we will take LCM. So we will get P in bracket 11 by 10 whole raised to power 2 which is equal to 121P upon 100. Now this amount which we got at the end of second year becomes the principal of the third year that is 1 to 1P upon 100. Now that we have got the principal of the third year that is 121p upon 100, we can find the interest of the third year on this principal. So the formula will be SI3 is equal to P3 into R into T upon 100. Now further we shall put the values. So P3 is 121p upon 100, R that is rate of interest is 10%. And time period is one year because we are only calculating for the third year that is one year. Now further we shall simplify and we will get 121p upon 1000. So we have got the simple interest for first year. We have got the simple interest of the third year. And now the difference between the two that is the simple interest of the third year and the simple interest of the first year was given to us in the question 1105. So now we shall put the values. So we shall write 121p upon 1000 minus p upon 10 is equal to 1105. Now further we shall take LCM which is 1000 and we shall multiply 121p minus 100p is equal to 1105 which is equal to 21p upon 1000 is equal to 1105. Further, let us cross multiply and find the principal. So p is equal to 1105 into 1000 upon 21, which is coming equal to rupees 52,619.04. So principal in this question is coming rupees 52,619.04. So this is it. Hope you have understood the question wherein the difference between the interest of the first year and third year was given to us. Please do like and subscribe my channel. Thank you everyone. Have a wonderful day ahead.